Hey guys, Sanan from Car Inspected here, and I just wanted to cover a quick topic today is the uh, uh, TPMS or Tire Pressure Monitoring System. Um, that light, when it comes on on your dash, if your car is equipped with one, you need to be careful, uh, pull over, and check the pressure on each tire. Um, you can visually inspect it. Uh, if the tires look or seem to be inflated and uh, the light is on it could mean that you have a nail in one of your tires uh, which is preventing the air from escaping but these systems are uh, usually uh, very precise and uh, if there is a change in pressure as little as 2 uh, to 3 psi uh, pounds per square inch in any of the tires it will notify you there are two systems so uh, two TPMS types of systems uh, some of them have a fully electronic uh, sensing system which is there is a sensor in each tire it sends a signal to the car via radio so uh, it radios in a signal to the car showing the pressure on each tire uh, that's a more precise system generally speaking and there is uh, one that uh, uses your ABS sensors or your traction control sensors uh, where your traction control measures the uh, speed of rotation on each tire and it gives you um, if there is a misbalance or if there is one tire that's rota rotating slightly faster than the rest uh, which means that the radius is reduced which means that it has less pressure on that specific tire then the system will trigger uh, a TPMS light or a tire pressure monitoring system light now these systems the the ones that use uh, the rotation speed of each tire they have a reset button and uh, that does not mean so because I've seen this before where people say that I had the TPMS light so I went and I pressed the reset and it should be fine no that is not the case a reset uh, is and I know it's mentioned in all of the user manuals and all the cars but um, I just want to emphasize it that these um, uh, that reset light is only you're supposed to reset or you're supposed to press that uh, button uh, only when you um, refill the tires or replace the tires so if you're replacing the tires or refilling them with air uh, and you're double checking the pressure which you should do every three to four months uh, or every change of season then uh, you press the reset button on those systems on the fully electronic the one that has sensors in the wheels I suggest uh, well the sensors do uh, measure the pressure in each tire and uh, uh, the only way that you'll be able to uh, reset them in most cases is to uh, use the diagnostic software of the vehicle which means if you don't have that software then uh, the reset software then you might have to take it to the dealer to reprogram the uh, TPMS with new sensors if you replace them but when you increase or decrease the pressure on each tire then uh, the, there is no need to reset uh, or reprogram uh, those sensors anyway I hope that this helps somebody out there and um, we'll see you on the next video